So how many times I have told that $6.5 levels is going to provide a very crucial support for NG and that is what has happened last week, eventful week. So NG has seen a good drop till towards 6.5 and then bounce back a smart recovery, close the week at 7.68 levels. What is going to happen next week? We will try to see with the help of candlestick charts and indicators. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe and comment. And yes, I am Ankit and welcome you all to my channel. Let's start the day with NG's analysis and yes do not forget to press the bell icon if you are interested into other global markets and commodities you can also watch my daily analysis and the weekly analysis as well for gold, silver, crude oil and index including Dow Jones, Nasdaq, FTSE 100, Germany and India. So let's start the analysis do press the bell icon. Now look at the weekly charts on the weekly charts we can clearly see lower highs lower lows it has created as this channel and probably it is trying to create this pole and flag formation so next week if you see it trading above eight dollar levels close your eyes go long it is going to go high it is going to again start this rally and try to achieve nine dollar levels again so yes above eight dollar levels it is good to remain long at the same time one can go short at 7.4 below 7.4 i'll be again looking forward to seven dollars and then this time if it tries to breach it can try to go till towards 6.2 dollar levels but we'll try to see with the help of indicators and other time frame charts that what is it going to happen on the weekly charts it appears below 7.4 it's a good shot below eight above eight dollar levels close your eyes go long and when i say this it means that you have you can go long and it is going to rise uh, strongly above eight dollar levels now look at the daily charts on the daily charts if you look at the last three candles see first it has achieved this high higher highs have been seen retracement and you can see precisely it has got this support at 6.5 now 6.5 is trading as a, a strong barrier for any downward move also look at this the previous two candles higher highs lower lows and this was the breakout it tried to break past eight dollar levels failing to do so now if you see it trading beyond eight dollar levels next week probably that is a time when one can just remain long beyond which and probably the first target is going to be towards 8.5 and then it may try to achieve nine dollar levels again so yes the daily charts also confirm the same at the same time below 7.4 here it may try to come back again on the downside the first target is going to be 7.27 and here at 7 and 7.2 we might get some stronger support so do not miss this zone probably from here it can again try to bounce back on the upside that is what it appears on the daily charts right now it is still trying to trade in this bullish channel it has seen this lows and probably trading with the highs there and may try to achieve further highs if it continues to trade in the bullish zone now coming back to the monthly candle on the monthly candle see it has achieved the lows it has achieved the highs the $9 levels it has already seen and it is trying to trade the candle in green previously there was a gap left out there it is filled with the sharp move at 6.5 now it is trying to bounce back again so yes beyond $8 levels definitely we may see a sharper green candle which will try to take it towards 9 9.18 and 9.3 dollar levels in fact it can try to go further high in the month of May itself we may see it trying to go further high and how high it can go it can it can in fact try to achieve well above these levels if you recall my previous prediction i have told you that ng has almost come out of this zone this was the sideways zone it has traded for months and years see 2010 till 2022 ng is has come out of this zone and it has long way to cover how far this could go I would be looking forward to this zone at 12 and 13. NG may try to hit this zone and in fact it can try to create a double top at $15 levels. Soon in few months we may see NG hitting those levels. This is my expectation and probably this could gonna realize soon. Now look at the 4 hour charts on the 4 hour charts too. Similarly you will find higher highs have been done and the channel is still kept intact this was a breakout failed to sustain below these levels it is again trying to come back now look at the near term here on the near term this is trading sizes 
this is the channel in which it is trading and that is why i said below 7.4 yes you can expect it to go back till towards seven dollar levels and once you see it trading above eight dollar levels we may see it sustaining above this and 8.5 is the next target nine dollars and in fact it can achieve higher highs towards 9.18 9.3 dollar levels so this is what we can infer from the candlesticks but now let's have a look at the indicators indicators on the four hour chart see first for a chart you will find that there is a resistance at eight dollar levels at the same time there is a very strong support here at 7.6 7.7 zone which is a very strong support zone and next it is going to get till towards 7.4 below 7.4 yes i will be considering this as a bearish move and i will expect it to drop sharply below those levels now if you look at the stochastic this is also looking downwards appearing to be bearish and macd is trying to converge crossover indicating that if it crosses over we may see some bearish move here rsi not showing any signs here so yes indicators are at quite comfortable levels and in fact uh, the crossover on macd is something which is something i'll be looking forward to if it doesn't if it fail to break and sustains the bullish levels probably we may see again a rise on ng now look at the daily charts on the daily charts you'll find see this is the median of the bands here and this is also the 20 period exponential moving average which is trying to give it a support here at around 7.6 levels breaking this breaking specifically 7.4 you can expect that it is going to hit back at 6.8 which is going to be a stronger support 6.8 levels and below that it may try to come back till towards 6.5 on the upside breaking eight dollar levels here it may try to rise a bit but yes it has for next couple of days it may try to consolidate with lower highs and higher lows and then a breakout may appear so yes any long above 8.8 dollar levels it not 8.8 .8, but eight dollar levels is a good entry to go long and below 7.4 it here one can go short this is again confirmed on the charts here and if you look at the daily stochastic this is again bullish and if you look at the mag the MACD is trading with a bearish note here it is already on the sell side and if you look at it, it is running parallel here so it is not showing much of the bearishness but yes it is still in sell zone it requires couple of more green candle for it to cross over again on the buy to, to get a crossover on the buy side however right now it is trading with a slightly bearish bias and if you look at the RSI the RSI has seen lower lows and lower highs so this is trying to trade in this channel probably it may try to achieve once the lows and then bounce back again sharply that can be expected this is one of the possibilities which we are looking forward to and if you look at also the directional movement if you look at the directional movement is still in green they see there was wide divergence a strong bullishness was seen a little convergence is still trading in green now it has come back to a convergence and a crossover point but it failed to do so again trying to diverge and if it tries to give you more green candles we can see it diverging again a stronger bullish moves can be observed on ng next week and if you look at see it is trading above the 20 50 and 100 period moving averages here now ng is very much in the bullish zone it is already in bullish zone but yes despite the drop we can expect that it can try to bounce back again strongly and yes on the daily charts similar is the observation and if you look at the weekly charts out there on the weekly charts we can observe that there is a strong support at six dollar levels and then below that at five dollar levels it should not breach these levels any point of time on the weekly charts if it does we can expect a sharper drop but yes look at the directional movement see it was divergent till here and it is trying to converge probably and it if it tries to reverse that is something i will be looking forward to whether it reverses and diverges again there could be strong bullish move on ng here that is what i can sense and if you look at the stochastic this was overbought again coming down and trying to look upwards from here macd is wide and divergent so this is one possibility which is trying to refrain me for more stronger bullish moves here that is on the weekly charts the ng is hitting the high on the macd almost divergent hence one can you know i'll be expecting it to give red candles on the weekly charts but these are markets anything is possible so i will prefer to trade as per the levels and do not go by the indicators or because indicators most of most of the indicators give you mixed signals here 
and RSI is also overbought here and if you look at the monthly charts on the monthly charts NG is again overbought MACD stochastic is near to overbought levels and if you look at the uh, divergence here on the directional movement this is also bullish here and anyways the support there on the quite low at monthly charts considering considering this let me give you the trading levels for next and yes before I give you the levels if you have any trading or trading related queries you can reach out to me via telegram or email my telegram and email ids are mentioned in the channel and video description also you can be part of my next mentorship batch the seats are filling up fast learn the strategy learn the art to master the craft of trading and once you are a master definitely you can make profits for lifetime so join my mentorship batch it is a 15 day session and 90 minutes every day you can reach out to me for more details also you can be part of my vip signals group where just by trading as per the signals you can definitely profit reach out to me for details now look at the trading levels here next week if you see ng trading above 7.91 you can go long and the target the nearest resistance is at 8.0 beyond 8.0 i'll be looking forward for it to directly achieve 8.2 8.2 3, 8 and then 8.5 8.5 may provide a little resistance and this is a bigger milestone for ng for next week if it breaks this we may be looking forward to 8.8 .8 .8 .8 and 8.98 levels in fact beyond this it may try to achieve higher highs in at 9.15 beyond this sky is the limit and it can achieve and it can do wonders beyond these levels so stay cautious take your positions accordingly on the downside if you look at one can go short at 7.4 which is going to be a stronger support one can go short at 7.4 below 7.4 we'll be looking forward to 7.18 and 7 dollar levels this is a good support and 6.8 which is a very good support for ng on the downside if it breaks this again we'll be looking forward to 6.5 levels very strong support at 6.5 breaking this nobody will stop till 6.2 dollars below that sky is the limit i am not going to give you levels this is beyond me and you if it trades and breaks these levels anything is possible these are markets take your positions accordingly between these 7.4 and 7.9 we have to be a little bit cautious here we have to be a little bit observant probably any break on the upside definitely will be a sharp break which will try to create double top or beyond those levels also so take your positions accordingly Thank you very much. Have a great profitable trading week ahead. Do not miss the daily analysis on NG just with the Asia Cash session. So press the bell icon. Thank you very much. Have a great profitable trading week ahead.